Fish are actually drawn to changes in light. Sports fishing boats sometimes use bright lights to draw them to the surface. You fish, Ken? Only for food. Same way I hunt. Do you hunt and skin your belt? Of course. The autopsy report and Mark Harris. Oh, he seems lovely. Yeah, I am not sure I understand what's going on with that guy. Did you know that because of all the pollution, the bass are changing sexes with the males carrying the eggs? Well, it's about time. You did not know that. Yes, I did. I read it in a science journal. You? I read it in that book Skeet gave me. Interesting. Skeet? The book and the picture he drew. He put a sex drawing in a fish book? What is wrong with you? No, he drew a picture of me fishing. It's very flattering. Waiters are a nice look on you. OK, what are we searching for again? Evidence that the fish I autopsied was transported to and somehow held in this lake. Which might help us figure out who planted it there, and that would lead us to the killer. We discussed all this in the car, did we? Oh, I see. You just needed a break, didn't you? No. I was just recapping. Why can't we do this with a motor? Because it will scare the fish, and fear does not equal attraction. Which is what is so interesting about Skeet. He's not afraid of you. Well, I'm not interested in Skeet. Because you're afraid. I'm not afraid of Skeet. No, you're just afraid that Skeet doesn't look like what you thought you were looking for. Well, I'm not sure what I'm looking for, but I can tell you one thing. It's not Skeet. If Jane asks, you rode. You two have a unique relationship, don't you? Still trying to figure it out? Me too. Still seems strange, this whole idea of fishing as a sport. Imagine how the fish feel. <laughs> Do you follow any sports? The usual things, arm wrestling. Caber toss. I can never tell when you're joking. I know. Can you give me a hand? <sighs> Got it? Go! Be free! Until you bite down some shiny piece of plastic and somebody with a brightly colored shirt pulls you from your watery home, weighs you, measures you, and flings you back into the air. Is that fish empathy or another indicator of a bizarre worldview? I'm better both, I guess.